Welcome to another video explanation of functional skills level two reformed. This is the non-calculator paper and it's from the paper with reference that you can see on your screen. Okay, let's go to the question that we are dealing with. Okay, so let me read the question. The scatter diagram gives information about the temperatures at eight different heights up a mountain. So there's the scatter diagram. So I have already put in the line of best fit. It wasn't there originally. Um, what was there originally is just a series of crosses. At a height of a thousand meters, the temperature is minus 13 degrees C, which stands for centigrade or Celsius. A, plot this information on the scatter diagram. B, draw a line of best fit on the scatter diagram. Please note I've already put that in, that wasn't already there. C, use the line of best fit to estimate the difference between the temperature at a height of 550 meters and at a height of 950 meters. Okay, so what I like to do is to put that in context of the curriculum that we've been going through. So this is my interpretation of where they've got this question from in terms of the curriculum they have set. Draw and interpret scatter diagrams and recognize positive and negative correlation. Positive and negative correlation is not necessarily in the answers this time. Um, usually is, but I will go through what sort of correlation this has turned out to be. Another thing that we are dealing with is read, write, order and compare positive and negative numbers of any size. Okay, let's go back to the question. The scatter diagram gives information about the temperatures at eight different heights. So these points are the eight different heights up a mountain. At a height of a thousand meters, the temperature is minus 13 degrees C. Plot this information on the scatter diagram. So 1,000 meters, go to the X. Temperature is done on the Y axis. So go down from 1,000 to where you meet 13 degrees C and then put a cross. I've already put a cross there, but it was there. Okay, so putting a cross, that is plotting the information. B, draw a line of best fit on the scatter diagram. Again, I've put that line in. So the line is always straight. It doesn't have to go through all the points, it doesn't have to go through any of the points, but just what you think is the best fit for all the points there, as long as it's a straight line. So I have put this line here. Use the line of best fit to estimate the difference between the temperature at a height of 5,500 meters and a height of 950. So I have put that on a separate diagram so it didn't get confused. So again, almost like turning it into a conversion graph. So 550, so there's 550. Go down to where you meet, meet the um, the line of best fit, so from here to there, and then across, so you can estimate the te temperature. So the temperature minus five. 950, again, find 950, go down to the line of best fit, and then across to the temperature. So the two temperatures there, the difference, minus five and minus 11, these two points here. The difference between the two is six. 